matter. It's stars, planets, animals, plants, and probably anything else you can think of. Altogether, it makes up a measly 5% of the universe. So what the heck makes up the rest? It's one of the biggest mysteries of the universe. We call it dark matter, and it makes up about 25% of the universe. We have no idea what it is, but we think it exists? So, yeah, we don't know much about it. But why do we think something is there? Well, when you calculate why the universe is structured the way it is, we realize that all of the stars, planets, and dust interaction with gravity just isn't strong enough to form galaxies. We need something extra. Something that doesn't interact with light, but does with gravity. Dark matter. When we look into places with a lot of dark matter, you can see that its gravity can bend the light. So we know something is interacting with gravity, but we just can't see it. We don't know what it is, but we do know what it isn't. We know that dark matter is not made up of black holes nor regular matter. We know that it's not antimatter because the particles would pair up with regular matter and get annihilated. The only thing that we know is that there is something out there and it interacts with gravity. Dark matter is probably, maybe, made up of WIMPs, or weakly interacting massive particles, also known as tons of tiny particles that have mass and interact with almost nothing besides gravity. Because they rarely, if ever, interact with anything else, they're extremely hard to detect, and that's why we know so little. How do you study something that you can't see or interact with? So, the best answer to what dark matter is, is that we don't know. Maybe it's some weird explanation that doesn't even include dark matter? Maybe the absence of knowledge will keep you curious of the mysteries of the universe, and eventually lead you to study dark matter. And as always, thanks for watching, and have a super duper delicious day.